Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage your Footballer of the Year for 2018, Mo Salah. Congratulations to you, the first African, the first Arabic player to win the Footballer of the Year award. How does it feel? Great, you know, it's an honor to win this award. It's, it's a special, no one won it before in Africa or Arab. So I'm very proud to win it. It's coming up soon, the Champions League. Can Liverpool do it? Can you beat Real Madrid? Of course, of course we can. We, we play in the semi final and the quarter final against Man City and Rome. Both teams are very good, you know, they have uh, special quality, they are you know, outstanding this year. But, you know, as I said, we will, it's only one game, it's, it's not long, it's just one step, so we have to keep fighting and, you know, I'm excited and everyone in the city and like, the team is excited about that, so let's see. It's a really proud moment for me um, to be the first recipient of this award, uh, one that I'm not taking lightly at all, you know, I'm very privileged. Um, to be here and to be able to collect this award among some great nominees um, and obviously for the first time it to be a female award so that's amazing. But I'd like to play a particular tribute to the winner, Frank Kirby. She's, she's my little number 10, she's the one that I look to to unlock the door with individual brilliance. She's had an unbelievable season for Chelsea and for England. The biggest quality I can say about Fran is that she is a really good footballer. She wants to be the best footballer in the world and she, she will achieve that with her dedication. But she's a fantastic person as well. It's a massive achievement for me and for women's football and I hope that we continue to get your support uh, throughout all the seasons now in women's football because it really is going to the next level. So thank you very much for having me and I hope you have a lovely evening. We are indeed here to honour the win winner of what has been as thrilling a race for the Footballer of the Year award as I can remember. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage your Footballer of the Year for 2018, Mo Salah. Mo, very many congratulations, and as you look up there, amongst all the winners of the Football Writers Association Football of the Year, you'll see so many Liverpool legends, Kenny Dalglish, Ian Rush, Emlyn Hughes over there, look, Terry McDermott. What does it mean to you to win this award? Good evening, everyone. I want to apologize first to all of you to make you waiting until now, but I have to get another two awards from Liverpool. So I get them, then I come straight. You know, it's always, always, I'm always happy when I feel I achieve something, I get a award, so I work hard for that. I always want to help my team, so I'm always happy to win an award. I was here like four years ago, and a lot of people said he couldn't success, and he cannot, you know, he cannot play in a Premier League. It's very difficult for him, so it was always in my mind to come back. From day first I left Chelsea, it was always in my mind to come back to make them wrong. So I make them wrong. It's something huge for me, so I'm always trying to do my best to, to, to improve myself as a person, as a player, so it's something, of course, important. Joy to meet you. Thank you very much for talking. Thank you. Thank you. Your football writer, Football of the Year 2018, Mo Salah.